What's up, party people? Rob Hunter back with you. The trendy topics that are going on in this news. Have you heard about this one yet? The case of Steven Slevin? Yeah, here's this guy. This is what he looked like before he went to jail two years ago. No big deal. He got busted for a DUI charge, and then they threw him in jail. They left him in solitary confinement for two years all by himself. He never went to see a judge. He never got a trial. Nothing. This is what he looked like when he came out. Look at that beard. It's a crazy beard. To make matters worse, the homeboy got a toothache while he was in solitary. They wouldn't let him see the dentist. So what did he do? Pulled out his own tooth. And his toenails grew for two years. He got all kinds of crazy foot fungus. Well, the case is finally over. He was awarded $15.5 million by a jury of his peers and judges and all the like. But somehow that doesn't seem like enough. Maybe we need to add a zero in the middle of that, 150 million. That would seem like good restitution for Mr. Slevin. Sorry you had to go through that, my man. Trendy item number two, Sparky's got a new look. And look at it. He looks all nice and cute and friendly. That's what ASU came up with because they want Sparky to be more kin friendly. But let's be honest. He looks like he's gonna start a revolution. Maybe he's gonna overthrow the president of Egypt or something. Ah, maybe he should just overthrow the ASU Athletic Department. Finally, ASU Athletics could be good. Yeah, sorry, I said it. All right, trendy item number three in the news this week. It's time for a new national anthem. I've got the perfect song to replace it, R. Kelly's Remix to Ignition. Seriously, this is a petition on WhiteHouse.gov. I've already signed it. We only need about 90,000 more to get a serious response about changing the national anthem from the Obama administration. I'm not trying to be rude, but hey, pretty girl, I'm feeling you the way you do the things you do. Come on, seriously? You love this song. I know you do. And any song that mentions the word Afro in it, as in running her hands through my fro, deserves to be at least considered for the national anthem. And the song's still hot and fresh out the kitchen. I gotta get out of here. I'm Rob Hunter. Word up to Biggie Smalls. Anniversary of his death this week. Gotta point that out, too. We'll do it again right here on KTR.com next week. See ya. Do this, but not this.